Hey, I'm Jay from the Cub Scouts. Welcome back to another episode of Free Random Games, a series where I find some of the most random games out there on the internet, and I play them for you guys right here in this video. I can't promise you guys that they're going to be any good, but I can promise you guys that we're going to have some fun, so if you guys are cool with that and you're down with that, everybody get ready and buckle up, because here we go. First game of today's episode is called Dead Noise, and I'm going to keep it 3,000% with you guys. The only reason why I thought this game was worth playing was because the guy we're playing as looks like Senpai. So we got to go across this bridge right now in this cold weather. Our Japanese balls are probably shriveled inside of us, and we got to just talk to this girl right here. Hey, what are you doing here? You don't know? Well, why don't you do me a favor? Go inside that tower behind me and bring me the Awakening Orb. Make sure you have it equipped when you talk to me again. To equip an item, open the menu with the tab key. All right. So, whoa! Dude, I just shot up like a shark out of somebody's asshole. Wait, did I give him the thing? Hold up. Uh, awakening orb. Equip it. Did I do it? Do you have the awakening orb yet? If you do, make sure you equip it and talk to me after that. Okay, I'm trying to. Awakening orb is in my inventory. There you go. Got it. Okay, so I got the orb now. So, let's talkie-talkie. Oh, wow, you found it. So you really want to know why you're here? Well, I'll tell you. Guess what? This is a dream! And the reason you're having your... is... What the heck? You need to realize that... Because that's basically what it says. So let's go inside that ball. And now what? Come on, go ahead and equip the awakening seed I just gave you so you can awake from your dream. Okay, we gotta awake from the dream. It's time to get woke, guys. Ready? Let's do it. Bam! We are now woke. We have now snorted the waking seeds, I think. Oh, wait. Here I am. See? I'm Senpai, guys. Senpai going on an adventure. la di da di da da di da Wow, look at the environment, guys. It's so amazing. Who's this? Oh, it's a ghost. It's a crying ghost lady. Okay, let's talk to her. How do I talk to you? I can't see the letter above your head. How do I talk to you? Is it Z? Oh, what? When did I get this? Wait, is that what I do? Oh, what the heck? Bro! Why am I going like Duke Nukem on somebody's bitch ass? I went from talking to my bae to Michael Bay real quick. Why are there so many explosions on the screen? You died. Jackass. In like the tiniest baby dick text ever. Okay, I died. So what? Bring me back to life. Where's that awakening orb when I need it? Also, we only have the ghost gun or the lucky charm. And then we start to go first person mode. But do I kill this girl? She's already dead. It would be kind of redundant, right? If I kill the ghost? Hold on, let me talk to her. The ghost said, ta ta ta. Okay, uh, can I talk to the tombstone? Is that my body? Is that my nice, sexy body? Uh, what do you want from me? There you go. What do you want from me? Uh, I want your blood! Let's go! What's up, baby? Let me talk to you. Why did you have to do that? I don't know! Oh my god, that scared me. Why did that even scare me? That is so dumb. Did I die? I died. Alright guys, so now it's a new day. I had to stop recording because my eyes started to get like really watery and my nose got really stuffy. I think I had like an allergy or something while I was recording. But we're back, you know, we're fresh now. We're watching um, this game called Spongebob Badlands or something like that. So this is the next game of today's episode. So let's play. Oh my god, I feel like we're in for a treat. Downtown! Yes, what is this? A slider? What is this? Adjust brightness? Adjust the game's betterness? What is this? Oh, reach the sponge lands. Okay, guys, we gotta reach the sponge lands. I don't even know who the hell we are. We're some green bug eyed cucumber looking freak. Whoa! What? Oh, come on. Bro, this is the game? Uh huh. This is what I'm. Oh my god. Okay, Badlands? Can I go in the car? Dude, are we under the sea? Or, like, are we on land? I don't even know. We're just gonna try to make it to the sponge lands. And it fires automatically. All I gotta do is point the laser beam to their freaking heads. Look at this. Blah, 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 blah. Oh my god, the game is so laggy. Where the fuck are the sponge lands? Well, this game is a fucky wucky. I don't even know where I'm going. Do I go here? Please tell me I go here. I do not go there. Why did I even think I could go there? Of course I can't go there. There's no enemies either, guys. So, uh, maybe the sponge lands is all the way to the right. It's gotta be. I think this is the right place. Yeah. Okay, this is a new area. 
Sponge lands. Here we go. More enemies. Let's get it, boys. Oh my god, I think I found the sponge lands. Come on, get down to the goddamn sponge lands. Why won't you go down? Dude, please drop down to the sponge lands right now. Right now, or else I'm gonna spank you. All right, you know what? Whatever, whatever, whatever. We're not going down there. We're just gonna keep going this way. I don't think that we can go down there, so we're just gonna keep going to the right, and hopefully something good happens. I highly doubt it, but just hopefully, please, please, for the sake of me, for the sake of all the people watching at home, for the sakes of your mothers and daughters and fathers and dogs and rats. Why did music randomly start? Stop, stop, God damn it! get off me, get off me, get out of Get me through these shit trees, these doodle ass trees. Whoo! Okay, we survived. We survived. No more bitching. No more bitching. I'm not even bitching. I mean, everything I'm saying is facts right now. This game is straight up cheeks. Straight up unwiped doodoo dingleberry cheeks. Fuck, Patrick, get off my dick. Get off my dick. Oh, get off my dick! What? I died. I can't believe I died. That was the death animation right there when that guy was going like this. That's how you die in this game. And this is how I'm gonna next this game. Next game is called Sean. Are you listening? Basically, what you're trying to do is you're trying to play a video game, but sometimes people walk in front of the TV, and that is so rude. We have to figure out a way to beat the game while people are interrupting us. So let's do it. Okay, so we gotta play Escape from Murder House 95. Okay, so this is pretty easy right here. All we gotta do is jump over all the obstacles in our way. But now somebody's bitch ass is interrupting us. What do you want? Okay, we gotta type in uh huh. Sure. And now she leaves. What a hoe, man. Our mom's a hoe. Okay, what score do we gotta beat? 156? Oh, that's easy. Dude, now you wanna come over here with your butt cheeks looking like it's from the front? Sure. No. Oh, dog. Don't do that, dog. Don't do that to me, dog. Come on, dog. You know you don't want a doggy style like that. Here we go. We got this. And we can lean from side to side like this. So we can kind of see what we're doing. Uh... Sure. Okay, I gotta type in sure as I'm jumping. Dude, that's crazy. I don't have three hands for this shit. I gotta actually play this game, and I have to talk to them while typing. I can't believe that. This game is gonna be harder than a Viagra popping dick. I gotta do what? Short jumps or something? Okay, jump. Oh, you son of a slut. What do I gotta type in? No? Dude, I... <laughs> oh, man, this is hard. This is very, very hard. Damn, dog. Come on, stop moving in my way. Almost time to go. What does that mean? Does that mean I suck at this game? Stop! Stop moving in front of the screen! Yes! Type in yes. No. Type in no. Fuck! Dude, this game is so hard. Guys, okay, I'm gonna tell you how hard this game is. So I have to look down for the quotes to type in. And then I also have to keep jumping or else I'm gonna die. I have to maneuver my left hand to type in all the letters on the screen. And obviously I won't know what the letters are because I gotta look down. Why do I bitch? Why do I bitch, guys? I bitch and moan, but it never solves anything, okay? Bitching and moaning. Moaning and bitching. Just keep jumping over these damn cats. And the coffins. What? I failed. I know I did. Failed to beat the high score in time. Sean went on to never play video games ever again. Damn, why is this bitch so extra? You can just beat it the next day when nobody's moving in front of the screen. All right, let's do this again, guys. We got this. So we got to beat this in a certain amount of time. And I just got to keep leaning. I got to be on that lean. Got to lean to see the screen. Oh, my God. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's type in no. I walked in front of a cat. If you could beat this, you're pretty much a coordinated god or something. Because look at that. I jumped over the coffin into a cat. I jumped straight into the cat. I now I can't even I can't even see. Okay, I gotta get my hands ready, guys. I gotta type in yes, uh huh, sure, and no. Those are the words that I have to answer to my parents. Okay, we gotta type in no. And I walked into something. Anytime I look down, I automatically walk into something. We got this, guys. Our last attempt. Come on, don't let my parents come in front of me. Wait, nobody's coming in front of me. I think I glitched it. Let's go, boy. What? No! I think the only time to beat this is at night when you're on your last attempt. Because then nobody walks in front of the TV. Because right now, it's almost impossible. It's borderline impossible! Guys, look at this shit. I'm gonna type in no, and I jumped in front of a coffin. I looked down for one second just to see where the N and O keys were, and I jumped in front of a coffin. Nobody's gonna come in front of the TV. We got this. I got the high score, baby. Watch me. Watch me. I'm telling you, the best time to- What?! Okay, I got one more chance. If I don't do this right now, I'm so done. I'm so freaking done. Come on, cat. What's up, cat? 
Let's go. What? Oh my god, whatever. This last game is called There's Something Strange About Uncle Howard. This is Uncle Howard right here. This creepy looking great value slender man. We're having dinner with our whole family, including the dog. So let's see how this goes. Uncle Howard said, So you finally let me in, huh? Don't you fear me? Well, it doesn't matter anymore. If you need something, I will be here. If you don't, I'll be here too. I'm really excited about all of this. You can call me in any occasion. I think it would be fun. After all, within every problem lies an opportunity. Left mouse interact and right is pan. Oh, that is some dog shit controls. Okay, so uh, we can click on the dirty dishes. We can click on the empty dog bone jar. We can click on some makeup. We can click on a picture. And that's about it, man. Okay, so let's click on this picture featuring these creepy people. The frame in the porous wall is bent, but inside it shows a delighted memory of a delighted family. Dad still had all teeth to smile, mom is sun-kissed, sister is holding her head high, and the dog is fat as a contest pig. I miss those times. I was as fit as a fiddle. Back then, I could go to the beach, all right? No shame. Mom, you still look fine. Darn, easy for you to say. You never look like me. Damn, Mom. Why you gotta be so freaking savage for? Okay, um... Can we click on the picture again? No, we can't. Can I talk to anybody? Can I talk to the dog? Can he wolf-wolf me one time? Alright, let's click on this makeup. Uh, Ma, what happened to your face? Uh, what are you talking about? Uh, your makeup looks cakey today. Is everything alright? The mom's wrinkles folded even more in resentment as her lungs spit out in anger. Uh, are you calling me ugly? Hmm. You, who looks like you fell out of an ugly tree and hit every branch on the way down. Damn, Mom! If you're calling her ugly, that means you're butt-ass ugly, too. The day you come to this house with a good catch on that day, then you can mock me. <sighs> but I... Enough of this girl talk. Let me enjoy my meal, for God's sakes. And now the dog's gone. What happened to the dog? Where's my dog? Okay, now there's car keys here and a backpack. Let's click on the backpack. You notice that your sister can't stop looking at the stuffed backpack next to the door. You remember the night in which she spent hours on the phone with her boyfriend talking about the future. But you didn't expect the future to arrive so soon. Sister, I know sometimes this place feels like a living hell, but please, don't give up. I can't stand this anymore. I have to do something. It just gets worse every single day to get rid of this horrible feeling that grows bigger each day. I know that isn't easy, mainly for you. I get what you're feeling. It's hard for me too, but without you, it would be even worse. What the hell even is this game? Do you really think there's any hope for this madhouse? Yeah, I do. How? Together. What the hell do you mean together? Okay, now we can click on this bottle or we can click on dad's food. Let's click on the food. You know that I'm rough and have a heart hard like a rock, but it's in moments like these that I remember why I fell in love with you, woman. The food is granny slapping good. The mother smiles and blushes while directing a disapproving glance towards her husband. Interesting. Can I talk to Howard? No, I can't talk to Howie. How about this picture right here? Like a sunset, the photo was in warm orange and worn out tones. It shows mom back when she had her maiden name and could take every heart. Some days I can't even look at this photo. I was so young. Yeah, now you old and oogly googly. Mom, you know I love you. Stop dwelling on it. You're still beautiful, but beauty is not everything, you know? Sometimes you amaze me, boy. Okay. Oh my god. Who the hell are those people? And now I got an F? What? I'm all about the straight Ds. They say those who can't do, teach. Those who can't learn, quit. Those who can't be in a healthy marriage blame their children or their debts. Everything but themselves. What is going on with this game? Can I click on these people outside? Haven't you realized yet? A problem never comes alone. They don't come alone. They come in mobs with pitchforks and fire. How about we click on this music? Come fly with me. Let's fly, let's fly away. And now the dad's gone. Why is the dad gone? What does this mean? Well, here we are again, kid. Are you not tired of making the same mistakes? Wait, I failed the game? I didn't even know we could fail. I'm not even sure what this game is even about. Okay, uh, let's try it again. Let's click on the photo. 
And now the mom's gonna talk. She's gonna go yappity, yappity, yappity. And I'm assuming that we just gotta make the right choices in this game. And then we get like a good ending. So next, let's click on the makeup again. And then let's skip that since we know what that's about. The dog's gone though. Dog gone it. There's an empty piggy bank. What's that about? One little piggy loots some coins to run away from home. One little piggy is going to be crying wee 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 all alone. Don't be talking about my wee wee. All right, you know what? Instead of clicking anything else, let's click on this. Do you know what a man desires when he gets home? It's not reuniting with his kids. It's not kissing the sweet lips of his wife. What a man desires is a cold beer and some peace of mind. That sounds like baloney. That sounds like, whoa, what is that? I love this show. Me too, it's great. Nothing good ever came out of that box except static. I agree, for once. That's a weird image to look at. Why is there a gun? Whose gun is that? A shattering noise comes from outside the house, but no windows look cracked. If we only had an actual firearm, not this stupid BB gun, the kids could get hurt. Oh no, a life without kids? What a tragedy that would be. And now the mom's gone. Okay, I really don't know what I should pick. How about this bottle of the whiskey? You look at that big golden bottle with mixed feelings of anger and sorrow. All those terrible moments come to your mind. And now the guy's gone. I can't believe it. Did we get a good ending? You put your hand over the flyer and take a deep breath. Dad, we have something to talk about. It's about your... About your issue with... I have no issues, boy. Calm down, Dad. That is exactly the problem. You're sick and bringing everybody down with you. I'm tired to keep hiding my problems like they don't mean anything. A short time ago, I even considered to leave this house. I'm your daughter and I love you, but it's impossible to keep watching you destroy yourself like this. Darling, the kids are right. It's complicated to put up with the way you change when you drink. That's not you. When I see you in that stage, I really miss the man I once fell in love with. I miss the man who raised me. You used to be take care of us. Now it's our time to do it. Thank you. Thank you all to give a chance to this old rag. And they lived happily ever after. What the hell did I just play? All right, guys, but that's going to do it for this episode of Free Random Games. If you guys would like to see more episodes of this series, make sure you guys give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.